How's it going everybody? Welcome back to GeoGuessr and today we're going to try leg one of the stay at home league, a 32 leg pro league and the one that I'm in, just another world map where this came from. Uh, oh, two minutes per round. I need to be a lot closer. Okay, that is either Australia or New Zealand flag. Uh, I think ABC is an Australian news network. It appears to be a good, good-sized city. Let's try Newcastle for the moment. Okay. Whoa, whoa! What did I do? Return to start. Return to start. Okay. Alright, let's see here. I would say we're driving on the left, except this is a one-way street, but they are driving on the left. Okay. Road signage up here. Tasman Highway. So are we in Tasmania? So we'll try Hos Hobart. A3, okay. Hey, looky there, there's A3. I think we're close. All right. Yeah, one kilometer away. Ooh, I did better than the leader. I got six points more than the leader. All right, I am off to a rip-roaring start on this league. Okay. Samba. Wonderful Indonesia. Well, there we go. We're in Indonesia. A city would be helpful. Is this a road? 3C? Is that a, or triple IC? Is that how they name their roads in Indonesia? Ungabitut. Persa Tuan, Indonesia. So either Persa Tuan is the name of the city or Persa Tuan was like a greeting or something in Indonesia. Well, on these Indonesian cities, I always go to this island here since it's kind of central. I don't know where Persa Tuan is or if that's even a place name or a greeting, so I'm not going to go all in on that. I gotta say, I've seen this kind of signage in Bangladesh to maybe other places where they have like a billboard that goes over the entire road. That's really cool. Uh, a thousand miles. <laughs> well, <laughs> darn. <laughs> eh. Apparently the town was Atambua. Okay. Well, now we know. All right, this is very European looking. Uh, that is Portuguese. Uh, I'd say it's pretty pretty fair bet that we're in Portugal. Who's this guy here? Patron saint of that city. Someone do RD. Well, well done, do RD. How are you doing, Portuguese people? Oh, shit. Running out of time. So busy having fun with this that I'm not paying attention to the time. Okay, get in there, get in there, get in there. How about Porto? Why not? definitely Portuguese and not Spanish. I thought for a minute there I maybe should have gone with Spain, but... Ooh, another good guess. Man, I am cooking with gas here. Okay. Uh, okay, we got the ocean to our... Let's see here. North is to the right. So the ocean to our west. 
Looks like we're driving on the right, but this is a narrow road, so we could just be in the middle. Palm trees. Christianity. Thinking maybe Croatia. European Union crest. Well, there's the flag. I should recognize that flag, but I don't. I'm about to get schooled on what that flag is. This is a beautiful, beautiful little town. Well done to the map maker for finding this location. I am impressed. Okay. Not even close. It was out in the middle of the ocean. Some Portuguese island. Okay. Well, can't win them all. Uh, let's see here. Radio tax. Okay, that is definitely Spanish. Puerta a puerta, port to port. Looks like the colors of the Mexican flag. Yep, Mexico, that's Mexican road signage. Come on now. I wanted some city names to try to get a bead on where we are, where we were, not warnings about highway conditions. Well, we can say confidently that it's Mexico anyway. Tehuacan, is that a good name or a good place to put a Mexican, or a good guess for a Mexican city, I should say? I'll just not even be Mexico and I'm going to look like a fool. Oh, this has got to be Mexico. All this red, white, and green. Come on now. It was not Mexico. It was Colombia. Shit. Well darn. Uh, you know what? Not good for a first round. Not good at all. I had like one really good guess and got excited and tanked the rest. How am I doing here? I'm in 16th place out of 21. And these 21 people are obviously pats or these people in places 17 through 21 are obviously potsers. Okay everybody, thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.